Hello, Kyle here again with KG Appliances. I decided I'm going to start making videos on basically how to fix appliances that I do on a daily basis. Um, mostly for new technicians in the field. When I first started and I had to Google stuff, I know it gave you everything but exactly what you needed. Um, they kind of jump around from place to place to place. So what I'm going to kind of do here from here on out is get right to the point on what I do and everything along that line, but not overdo it. So hopefully all this works out and I can make more videos for you guys. So I have a Maytag washer here, uh, model number MVW7232 HW0. I just changed the slider in the bottom of the clutch down there. So what I want to do now is show you how to uh, put it into diagnostics mode to recalibrate. So you hit your power and you simply do one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Brings you into it. You'll get that message and you hit delay start. Hit delay start again. Brings you into service uh, options here. System information. We're going to do our fault code history first. F0 E3. Go to the next one. Hit delay start again so we can clear that. Um, perfect. Deep fill backs up. Um, <laughs> this one's a little bit different, but we're going to get through it here. You just got to find the right information here. Demo mode, we don't want that. You know what? I'm thinking we want number one there there we go so then you hit delay start and then we'll run a series of cycles here um, it'll put water in it'll spin what it's doing is it's syncing its machine and computer to the new slider I put in there uh, because this wasn't shifting correctly to start a load. It'd take like seven or eight times before it'd click in and start going. Um, takes a little bit after everything's said and done. When it gets done, all you do is you hit that power off. And you turn it back on and see what it does. But it'll do a series of events here. So I hope this helps you guys a little bit. If you have any questions, you can email me. 